up YouTube? It's your girl Miss Katrina G and I'm back with another video. Ms. Katrina G says, trust the process. Work your way through it. You got this. You're winning all year long. Yes, you're in control. So go ahead and trust the process. And it comes from Ms. Katrina G. So if you have love, remember, love conquers all. Love conquers all. It's everything. The total situation. You're going to win. Press your way through. You got this. Yes, because God is love. YouTube. It's your girl Miss Katrina G and I'm back with another video. Welcome, welcome, welcome back to my YouTube channel where I'm Miss Katrina G and we are the Love Jones family. To those of you who are new, newly subscribed to this channel, thank you and welcome to the family. Yes, welcome to the family. Also, if your girl popped up in your news feed and you just thought, hey, let me just check her out. Let me stop on by on this side of YouTube just to see what they're doing. Don't forget to subscribe. Do not forget to hit that bell so you'll miss none of the post notifications coming your way on this side of YouTube. And also, do not forget to give my video a thumbs up. Let me, girl, know what do you think about this video. Do not forget to comment down below because on this side of YouTube, we do post notification shout outs each and every single day. And I want you to be a part of it because you stepped through. You came and you showed your girl some love. And don't forget to share, 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 share this video with anyone and with everyone. Let them know what your girl Miss Katrina G and the Love Jones family is doing on this side of YouTube. Absolutely, we support each and every creator out there, but we're talking about what's going on over here on this side of YouTube. So guys, you already saw what I did. I made homemade Wu-Tang mozzarella sticks. I hope they did not get um, cold, but we're going to eat, we're going to eat, we're going to eat. Um, let's have grace, and then we're going to eat, and we're going to chit-chat. We're going to do a little story time. What the devil meant for evil, God meant for good. Heavenly Father, we thank you for this meal. We ask that you bless this meal and bless those who do not have a meal, Lord. We just ask that you continue to bless, Heavenly Father, our world, our community, our government, all that is needed. Heavenly Father, bless the Love Jones family. Bless the YouTube community as a whole. 
We thank you and we praise you for who you are in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Let me see about this lighting. Okay. I think that's a little bit better. <laughs> so guys, this is my outfit of the day. I know y'all like, she love wearing pink. I do love pink. This is like a peach. This is my favorite summer dress. And on this side of YouTube, guys, we're celebrating summer right now. Even though it's spring, we're dressing like it's summer. So this is my number four today, y'all. This is, it's a Rue 21 dress and it has the little ruffles around here in the bottom, y'all. There's two different layers like this, okay? So it goes from solid to um, lace to solid to lace. And it is the cutest little skirt. Um, a little halter, not halter top, but the spaghetti strap. And then I have, of course, I love my pearl, my rose gold pearl um, bracelet with um, the same as my watch. Today, guys, I wanted to wear my little um, peach nubs <laughs> little earrings and then i have my second earring in which is also it's like a flower and it's peach so that's your girl's number for today anyhow we about to eat y'all and chit chat i have a santa fe salad which is roasted chicken roasted corn um i put my own bacon bits on and they have tortilla chips and they have like a santa fe um dressing these are my homemade, homemade mozzarella sticks. So when you make them at home, you can make a jumbo or whatever you want. And I'm trying to remember to put the ingredients and how to make it, the recipe, in the description. And I also have my marinara, so let's get a thumbnail. Okay, let's get another one. All right, we good. So, yes, guys, with the devil meant for evil, God meant it for good. Mm -hmm. So good. I and mean, we all will realize we are. Mm. So this is egg roll wraps, y'all. I like to bread it, but egg roll wraps is on a different level. Mmm. Over here, y'all, we bring in the restaurant to the house. So. Your girl can throw down. <laughs> I can cook pretty much anything. Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm gonna learn. So guys, with the devil meant for evil, God meant for good, and we can all testify that there are some situations that we get into that we know that God is in the blessing business. And a lot of times the devil can see your blessing on the way Mm-hmm. Mm. And try to interfere. But no matter what, what the devil meant for evil, God meant for good. I'm going to tell you a story time. That it has um, really vexed my spirit. And what makes it even more serious is because it's a media situation. There's no need to sugarcoat. I think every testimony is another way to bless someone else and to help someone else who may be put in the same exact situation that I found myself in. Because what God meant for good, what the devil meant for evil, God meant for good. Mm -hmm. 
and no matter what's blocked, what's for you is for you, and the devil in the hell can't stop it. Mm. And if this mozzarella stick wasn't so good, I'd tell you why I say that. <laughs> They're really good. I put my garnish on it. You know how I like to top it and make it really pretty. Mm. Wow. This is good. And those of you who know me know I always have a reason for when I say stuff. There's always a method and a learning tool or learning lesson for myself. Just because I'm a teacher or, I, or I'm the content creator does not mean I'm not learning myself. Every time I'm here at home in my office preparing for my creation of my YouTube channel, my thoughts are what can help me. And what can help those who are watching me. It's important. Not what can hurt, what can help. So. As we get on this topic, guys, I've only been on this YouTube journey for, I would say, almost, not even really two months. And by the grace of God, I've moved very swiftly. I'm already monetized and I have almost, we're reaching, I'm at 91 videos in two months, guys. 91 videos. That's a huge celebration in itself. Um, and on this YouTube journey, I have seen some things that, like I said earlier, definitely vexed my spirit. Um, no, you don't know me personally, but, oopsie, sorry guys. But what you see with me is exactly what you get. You don't know me personally, but what you see with Ms. Katrina G is what you get. And um, I mean, that's just who I am, period, in life. And I have really good intentions about whatever I do. And my goal um, on this YouTube journey was to basically grow my YouTube channel, learn from other YouTubers. I have been fortunate to collab with several mm, big YouTubers. I consider big YouTubers that I have supported for a long time and I look up to. And that brings me to a situation that I ran into was with good intentions but it turned out to be um a situation that I didn't expect to turn out the way that it has turned out and um I'm not name calling that's not what I'm here for I'm not um pointing the finger or anything but the bible says be wise as a serpent humble as a dove and a lot of things we know we see we hear and a lot of times you think something is and it's not. Everything that glitters is definitely not gold. And I was fortunately to be fortunate to be invited to collab with a well-known um, YouTuber. And that individual, awesome person, inside and out. Simply amazing. But unfortunately, the surroundings of the individual caused for a great um, messy situation that little old me, blind, just excited about this new YouTube journey and learning, wanting to learn more about um, the creation of YouTube in general. And remember, and I don't say this I don't say this lightly. I was invited. I never asked or begged. I was invited. So I didn't think it was any issue with um, me coming out. I had already pretty much went viral with one other YouTuber 
and gained 2,000 subscribers in literally two days. If you have not seen the videos, go check them out. And I just thought it was going to be the same. Collab, network, and go home. Go home. And so, yeah, I definitely took time out from work. Spend money, whatever. But why not? I mean, it's a blessing to meet this individual because they're a blessing to me. No matter what, they're a blessing. And like I said before, it's their surroundings that blocked some things that shouldn't have happened. Anyhow, with that being said, I had got to a point where I was headed there and I had not heard anything. And I ended up having to go beyond what I would usually do. Because things were set in stone and I was literally headed there on the plane and so eventually I met up with the individual after reaching out through their um, their website and I was able to reach with them and guys we met and we hit it off I mean hit it off they were very apologetic apologetic about um, what happened um, we ended up talking networking and having a really really good conversation a really good time so much that we kind of like talk like actual like we knew when you're genuine and a lot of guys who came from the puff puff game understand what I'm saying this is the raw Miss Katrina G and you already know like I said what you see is what you get with me and just like with that collab we what we were very genuine it was like we knew each other for decades and so it's natural when you're genuine when you're faking it it's not natural you're not going to hit it off like that so me and the individual we chit chat had a really good time Ate, still hung out you know and we opened up to one another um and they were very sincere with what they were saying and that's why i said it was their surroundings that blocked me from getting or accomplishing what I actually initially came for and who they were connected with I had no idea who that individual was I never heard of them I never knew anything about them my um, respect was for this person who invited me to um, do business with them so and once I eventually, once that person told me, hey, this individual did not want me to do it, I literally had to fight my way to get here. And I'm like, I'm, I'm scheduled to be here for a whole week. I mean, like, <laughs> what's going to happen? Like, are we going to do business? What's what? So we did a little something. And it's unfortunate that that individual deleted it. They deleted it from... Um, person who I was meeting with and I guess they were upset that they were doing business with me but we initially didn't do what I was invited to do so I have a business to run as well which is my YouTube channel and it's always important to save face also but it's also important to be honest because your honesty could help someone else from not making the same mistake that I made. And like I said, the person who invited me, so genuine, awesome person. It's their surroundings that I knew nothing about and still really don't. I just know what um, I encounter with my experience with them without meeting them. And so, even so, even after that, we talked a lot. We talked about life. Uh, we still network. We still chit chat. We still had a really, really great um, chemistry. And I still talk to a lot of people I network with. Like, I'm just that open, cool person. So there's nothing wrong with that. And then they would tell me, you know, this person did not like some stuff that I'm writing. I'm like, I'm a supporter. <laughs> I support, if you do YouTube, small or large, I'm there. If I tell you I'm going to watch you, I'll step in, I'll watch your video. And it's not just because you watch me, it's because I have supported you from day one when you were small. And I'm that supporter when I like something, I stick with it. I stick with it. So 
Um, I'm like, but all I said was, great job. Or I would comment on how they did a prank or not just that. Anything. Something that's funny on the video. And they were like, well, this individual is very tight about you. <clears throat> and I'm like, tight about me? Little old me? Like, what? What is about me? I don't know them. And so, anyhow, even so, they were, uh, this individual is very supportive of most YouTubers from what I learned from them. And they watch the small YouTubers. The person who invited me out watched the small YouTubers. It does not matter, big or large. They really, really support um, the YouTubers. And I was amazed. It was like, they were like, yeah, I watch your videos. I think you do a great job. And they will pinpoint some things that I didn't, um, I would do that I shouldn't do. And I'm like, I'm all for it, you know, that you're helping me. And I really appreciate it. And so, I'm sorry y'all, I'm talking a lot, but it's a story time. Hmm. Still eating. So they would watch my video and they were like, well, I was out doing business with that individual and they were pit. I was gonna say pissed. They were. <laughs> they were upset that they were out, the individual was watching my video. I'm like, why my video? So, anywho, I guess the person was bothered by me. Um, why? I have no idea. Like, I am just Katrina. I am minding my own business and living my own um, life, my best life. And I'm thankful and grateful for whatever. And I support both of um, the individuals because life is too short to um, be trying to have any kind of animosity against anyone. I lost my mom and like I told that person, my mom was my motivation and my, um, just six months ago I lost my mom, for those of you who don't know. And so that was my drive to do YouTube, to keep my mind focused. And so when I found myself in the midst of the, the mess, that's what I see it as, mess. And you can look back on my videos, that's none of that on this side of YouTube still ain't um so that's something that you will have to learn I am still learning um to avoid but you can't avoid people who are envious of you who are intimidated by you all you can do is just be yourself keep shining keep glowing and live your best life and count it all joy I think I handled the situation very very well very well there was a lot invested in this entire process with me um, going and making the effort to do business because that's all it is strictly business okay and it's like the individual will not let them do anything with anyone I'm like okay and so um, anyhow yeah um, they would tell me that they didn't like them watching my videos they got upset about that and then they pretty much um said everything that i would comment and say whether i was saying congratulations great job there was an issue because it was me i'm like what <laughs> like why me i know why me but it is what it is because of who i am and um when people see your glow and people see your um integrity and in yesterday's video I said what profits a man to gain the whole wide world but loses his soul and you can say you're so sweet you're kind but it's how you treat people that would justify that um and I don't mean any ill will to anyone I pray for everyone my enemies alike but my um and this is good for me to get this off without name calling without bashing anyone it is what it is and people can see how they want to see it. This is a whole other side of Miss Katrina G. And still I'm classy. Okay. So with that being said. And still got a smile on my face. Thank you Lord. Uh, with that being said. I guess there was a place where they kept nagging about me. They said that the person just kept complaining. I'm like why me? And with that. I was blocked. 
y'all from everything i'm like what in the world how am i and as far as like the social media we communicated back then but we stopped and slowed down we'll talk here and there i'll ask advice here and there but um that was that and so all of a sudden i just got blocked and i'm like why am i blocked like all i said was great video or great job so anyways guys everything that glitters is not gold people can say um they are a certain type of person katrina g i can say who i am but i'm gonna tell you something if i show you different if i show you totally different that's who i am my life my attitude and if a person has an attitude that's what they are they have an attitude there's never an excuse i can be in my house guys and this is like i said before raw in my house begging the lord to take me out of the pain from thinking of my mom and thinking about my dad who have died within two years of each other at the same age please take it away but still come out with a smile so there's no excuse for treating someone in a bad way we all got to eat we all have to eat and if you're intimidated by someone the best thing for you to do is pray straighten your crown you're beautiful in your own skin you don't have to be intimidated or jealous of someone or try to block someone's blessings because you <coughs> oops excuse me because you are intimidated by them i got water on the stick side <coughs> because you are intimidated by them that doesn't mean uh, you do that like i'm here and gone i'm not sticking around so anyways i say this to say what the devil meant for evil god meant for good and i'm thankful to god for a spirit of patience for a spirit of understanding and a spirit of gratitude in spite of um, the things that the devil tried to shut down god keep it going god keep it going and god keeps me going god keeps the joy in my spirit he keeps the joy in your spirit <coughs> and the songwriter says sometimes you have to encourage yourself because depression is all around okay says the enemy create a war but we know that giants do fall speak over yourself encourage yourself in the lord encourage yourself some people may not like this video that's fine <coughs> it is what it is i'm not a huge youtuber <laughs> what i do i do it because i love ministering i love um i'm a people's person i don't have any um grudge against anyone i don't have a bad history of having grudges with anyone uh, my life speaks for itself so when i speak there's an authority that's coming out right now and there is also a um seriousness that's coming out right now there's a time for everything and so with that being said be careful of the company you keep because the company that we keep can either make you, can either break you, or it is what it is. But it's up to you to decide who is worth your sanity, who is worth um, your reputation, all those things that are above. And I'm pretty sure the person is watching because I was informed the person watches me and um, I was notified. Well, I noticed after I realized who the person was, I went to check them out and it was like they were t using my topics and stuff. And I'm like, I worked so hard for one of my topics and they got the same one and it was a couple days after mine. And I'm like, there's no way within the same couple of days that person knew. Once I realized I was being blocked, I realized what was anyhow whatever that is what it is god is able god is good and 
first and foremost, the devil ain't giving me my joy and the devil can't take it away. And what's for me is for me and the devil in hell can't take it. What's for you is for you and the devil in hell cannot block it. God is good. What the devil meant for evil, God will always mean it for good. So guys, thank you for watching this video. Comment down below what you feel, whether it's good or bad, whether you're happy or sad about anything that I said, that's perfectly fine. The comment section is for your opinion. I'm not gonna block you or cancel you because you have your opinion and every opinion matters to me. So, if you have not subscribed to this channel, do not forget to subscribe. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Let me girl, Miss Katrina G know what you think about my video. Don't forget to comment down below, as I said before, so you can be added to the post notification shout outs. And do not forget to hit that bell after you subscribe. I forgot to say that. Also, don't forget, guys, to share, 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 share this video with anyone and with everyone, letting them know what your girl, Ms. Katrina G, and the Love Jones family is doing on this side of YouTube. What are we doing on this side of YouTube? All right, guys, you never know what Miss Katrina G has in store, but there's always a purpose behind whatever the Lord puts on my heart. There's always a purpose. Anyhow, I'm going to do my shout outs. Of course, you know, I know y'all by heart. Mm hmm. Tracy Ann Jackson, she won the Fun Fact Friday, so that is, I believe, her last shout out, as well as Stacey Wilson. Guys, thank you so much. And my shout outs come from the previous video that I uploaded. Um, once you comment on that video, I will automatically submit you to be shouted out. So we got Eleanor Thomas, my girl, Roberta McRoy. Thank you so much, beautiful ladies. Also Gary Bateman in the building. What's up, Gary? Welcome back. Stay tuned, Gary. <laughs> my girl, Deborah Cooper, Ro uh, I think I said Rochelle Harrison. Rochelle, she comes through every time. Ms. B, hey, beautiful. My lovely auntie, love bug child, number one, and she was the love, job, love bug child, number one. Lynn Chisholm, what's up, Lynn? Miss Laverne Wilshire, Julia Martin, and Jazzy for sure. Also, me, Shelly B, check her out. Me, Shelly B, Deborah Toomer, and Cosuela Cohen. Lastly, my girl, Denise McKay. Denise, say what's on your mind, McKay. Go check her channel out. Thank you guys so much. I love you. Don't forget, I said this a hundred times. I'll say it again. What the devil mean for evil, God mean for good. And nobody can stop you. Keep grinding. Keep going. Big or small, you're going to win them all. Love you guys. Stay safe. Stay blessed. Check on somebody. And I will see you in the next video. Peace out.